Okay, so we just want to show you now what uh, we do to our pianos. We are extremely particular on the quality of our imported Yamaha pianos. And uh, so this is a U1 that has just arrived from Japan. And we're now starting the process of returning it back to as good as the day it left the factory. And uh, Paul's going to start by refacing the hammers first of all, which is a process of removing all the cuts from the noses of the heads, which uh, enhances the tone <coughs> and so forth. And uh, Paul, if you just want to explain what you're doing there. Right, I mean, this, this piano is as raw state as it's come off the container. Um, it's had absolutely nothing done to it. But as you can see, looking at it now, it's in very good condition already. So we're just going to try and bring it back to as new a condition as possible. It might be important to know that uh, a lot of these piano importers do not do this for the work for their pianos, they just sell them as they come off the container. So that is an important note to know. But the, um, the, this refacing is, it, is, it doesn't look too skilled, but it is a skilled job because you can't just keep going, otherwise you end up taking the felt down to the wood. This particular one isn't that bad. No, no, this is a very light use, like a good 90% of our pianos, I would say. <coughs> the important thing is, as you're taking it down, you're, you're always listening to the tone improving, and you get it to the point where you want to stop. You can uh, apply too much pressure, and then you end up breaking the hammer shanks, which is also not a... Uh, a very good idea. So it is quite a skilled uh, technique to do this. Obviously once the whole set's done then the action comes out and then it goes into the workshop and then it's all cleaned up, all the screws are tightened up, all the loops are changed which we'll come to it later. Um, all the keys are out, buffed, cleaned, regulated back in. Um, basically hours of work 